Hey guys, what's up? It's Anna Paola. And first of all, I want to thank all of you and especially my newest subscribers for subscribing after watching my What I Got For My Birthday video because like literally it went viral, not like super viral, but like I can say it's like way ahead of all of my past videos. Right now, so far it has 6,994 views and like when I first got a thousand views about a week ago, like literally I was like, what, like this is not possible, but I didn't think I would get past a thousand views and then like every like three days or two days, it would keep getting more views and more views and now it's at 6,000, like almost at 7,000. So that's like, that's, that's really cool, like I can't believe it, I really didn't think I would get there that fast. And it also has 134 thumbs up, which is what I usually get on my Instagram pictures where I have over a thousand followers. So I mean, that's that's really cool, really. Then again, I also have those 11 thumbs down, but ever since I started YouTube, I knew I wouldn't always get love. You know, there's always going to be people that don't really like you in life. Let me just be real, not everyone is going to love you. But the thing that amazed me the most is that, guys, exactly a month ago I had 118 subscribers and I currently, right now, have 308. So in less than a week, I grew 100 subscribers and like, that's, that's really, really cool. Thank you guys so, so much. I hope that I can grow my channel a lot more throughout my living years. And yeah, I just really wanted to thank you guys, like really. I'm so happy. I really wouldn't think I'd get there that fast. But anyway, today I decided to do a common struggles that girls go through because let me be real, being a girl is not that easy. And I'm not saying these are only for girls. These could also relate to some boys. So if you're a boy and you're watching this video, keep on watching because I bet you some of these you could totally relate to too. But anyway, let's just get started. This happened to me once when I was little and it was not very pretty. I had to cut off a piece of my hair because it was not sugar free gum. Uh oh. I'm pretty sure this has happened to almost everyone unless you like a nail expert and if you are then that's, that's really amazing. But I know that when I do my nails, always my right hand does not turn out that pretty because I am a righty so then when I do my nails with my right hand to my left my left will turn out pretty and perfect but my right hand not so much struggle number three we all love all the fancy colors on our lips especially with lipsticks but we all know that getting them on our cups or like our straw or anything that has to touch your lips will get stained Selfies. We just have to back at it again with the selfies. Most girls love to take selfies. I can say that I love to take selfies, but they don't always turn out perfect or like we wanted them to. Let's see, the lighting looks perfect here. Perfect selfie for Instagram. Okay. Why are they all so ugly? No. Ugh. Something that I actually struggle with a lot and then I have to like do some research or find other people's captions is captioning my Instagram pictures. I always want to have like the perfect caption and like simple and like cute. So yeah, for a lot of people, it's kind of hard to caption your Instagram pictures. I just don't know what I should caption this photo. Okay, so this happens to me not very often because, I don't know, I'm very careful with these kinds of things, but it has happened to me before don't like your crushes or any other person's old pictures. First of all, it makes you look kind of creepy. Like, okay, you're stalking me, like my old pictures. Yeah, okay, that's fine. No, try not to. Do your best not to. Or else... No, no, I did not just do that. No, 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 no. 
Can I just go into a black hole and die? Sometimes this happens to me a lot, like almost every day. And it's when you go to your pantry, you go to your refrigerator, and you think that you have nothing to eat. Like literally, there's food in front of your face. There's almost all kinds of food. And you're just like, nope, I have nothing to eat. I don't know what to do. My life is over. so done okay getting your hair stuck on lip gloss is not very fun because then your hair will feel all sticky and gross and I really hate when that happens because I use lip gloss a lot but I, I hate it okay this lip gloss looks fabulous I know we've all given at least one person a code name and you do that with your friends so that people don't know who you're really talking about but sometimes giving code names can be hard or like you don't agree on which code name but yeah I mean giving code names is fun but it can also be a struggle mm, I don't know I don't think that one sounds that good I think it's kind of obvious maybe popcorn or balloon monkey I don't know. I guess that sounds good, but I don't know if it's good enough. And last, it's when you do your eyeliner. You think it's going to turn out all flaky and perfect and just perfect. But sometimes it could kind of end up like this. Okay, it looks good. Oh, dang it. Now I made it too thick. I'll just do it to the other side. Ugh, no, now it turned out really bad. Ugh, I give up. So what did you guys think? Could you relate to any of these? If so, I would love you to comment down below, like the one that you can most relate to or the one that you could least relate to. And let's see if we can get this video to 25 thumbs up. I know we can do it, so let's get it to 25 thumbs up. And again, thank you guys so much for subscribing. It really means a lot to me. So if you're a new um, viewer to this video, then I would love you to subscribe. Click that subscribe button right there. And if you're on a mobile device, just click the red button at the bottom of this video or like at the description box. I don't know, but it will be there. You will find a red button and you can subscribe. I love you guys so much. Bye!